Every major professional sports league in the United States has a commissioner who is tasked with performing a variety of roles that help professional sports leagues function effectively. In a collectively owned league, such as Major League Baseball or the National Hockey League, the league establishes rules in its constitution and bylaws. A league's commissioner is responsible for interpreting, administering, and in some cases creating the league's rules. When a commissioner is fulfilling his or her enforcement and rulemaking responsibilities, it is important that the commissioner's actions are on the spectrum of rudimentary due process. If the commissioner's actions are found to fall outside of the spectrum of due process, then the commissioner's actions could be considered arbitrary and capricious. Recall that professional sports leagues are private associations that aren't subject to legal due process requirements. However, under private association law, a court may review a private association's actions if a private association acted in an arbitrary or capricious manner. A commissioner's authority to act in the league's best interest is derived from the league's formative documents. However, there are some limits to a commissioner's authority. A commissioner should only act in the best interest of the game which includes enforcing discipline actions, serving in a role as a final arbiter for disputes between leagues, clubs, and players, and other necessary actions needed to protect players and the league.